Hey, what's up guys? Today I am uh, outside and uh, there's this uh, cherry blossom here that's blooming. And basically today I have some uh, chores to do. You know, you can't be all the time inside uh, playing Clash Royale. So today what I have to do is I want to go get a haircut and I'm going to take you guys with me. Uh, while we're doing that, I'm probably going to show you uh, these two replays uh, from last night. And I'm also in this clan right now. It's called uh, Brazy Esports. And these are just some guys that I met off of uh, Facebook. And this is the leader here. Capitan America. There's like, just, there's a lot of like, uh, younger dudes here. And uh, I don't think there's any girls in this clan. Which is pretty typical with Clash Royale. Uh, but I got a pretty nice uh, ranking in the clan. I'm 17. Uh, it's good for me to be outside of my clan, I think, a little bit. Because when you lead a clan, it's different when it comes to your own personal uh, growth and practice. And I think a lot of that has to do with you playing with other people. And some, I don't know, for some reason, people in my clan just don't like playing against me. Like, I'm not really good, but so, some people play, but not a lot. Anyway, we're going to get going, and I'm going to show you guys a few replays on the way. All right, so here we are. We're, like, on this uh, busy intersection here, and uh, we got some uh, bakeries here. There's, like, ice cream shops and stuff, and uh, over here is, a uh, uh, like, a chandelier. All right, I'm using, like, a selfie cam, but this is the uh, high school right here. And that's a 7-Eleven, which is pretty big for this area, actually. All right, this place right here used to be called uh, Pete's Pizzeria, but they closed. So they sold owners, and it used to have, like, the best pizza, and they had this arcade machine called uh, Bibble Bobble. And it's basically, it was really fun. I'll, I'll show some videos of it if I can find. And check this out right here. All right, now uh, we are going to get on the subway. So this thing behind me, where is it? There it is. So that's the subway. Uh, we got Dunkin' Donuts over here. DDs. And okay, to get on the uh, subway, you need this thing, MetroCard, uh, for New York City. And there's like uh, there's girls buying some MetroCards there. So here, checks out. So there we go, we're going towards uh, Coney Island, and that's uh, the, the place, oops, sorry, the place where I'm going to get the haircut is there. Now, I'm not going to cut my hair off, like I've been thinking about it, but I think I'm just going to cut the neckline. Like I want the neckline to be nice and clean, so when I put up a ponytail, like I don't have like this peach fuzz sticking out, so I need to burst your bowl, but I'm not doing a whole lot. This is the uh, inside. We got the, this is new. These murals, and uh, this is uh, Manhattan, Brooklyn. That's where I'm at. This is uh, these are the beaches. So this is the uh, train tracks here, and the subway is about to come by, and the. The train line that I take is the Q line, and it goes all the way into Manhattan, and goes all the way south to Coney Island. And there's the train coming. I don't know if you guys can see it. See those two lights? Right there. Right, here's the train. Checks out. Man, when I was away for school, I went to a college in North Carolina to uh, study accounting. And when I got back, I felt like I was in Twilight Zone because you have to drive everywhere there. So let me show you the inside, but I have to be quiet a little. This is in Coney Island, Dubbo Avenue, Loud, Q, local train. The next stop is King Highway. Please remain clear of the closing door, please. We 
have arrived. So it's not very far from where I'm at. Um, it was like just two stops, but to walk it would have taken me like... Uh, check this out, I really like these lights. You see the... Man, you can't see it on camera, but you see these red lights? see them I think that was that's like the coolest thing when it's night it looks really nice so this is uh this is the area here you got your nice newsstand here there's a man in there uh, I, well okay so this is like a, a Chinese area like a predominantly Asian American uh, like Taiwanese and uh, not a lot of Korean people maybe look like Filipino check us out Donut, donut shop. Dude, should I get some donuts? Honey glazed, oh no, that's not glazed. Chocolate glazed. What else we got here? I'm not gonna show you like a lot of the uh, shops because I've been trying to get this haircut for like two weeks now. And with all the tournaments and stuff, I just, I can't get myself to get out. So, okay. Uh, I should probably make a note, the replays that you guys are watching is with the Princess uh, Barrel deck and it's just it's so strong, the deck is so strong and um, it's making its way up into meta for Crown, uh, for Arena Tower 11 and stuff like that. So this market right here has like a lot of uh, fresh seafood and like, vegetables and fruits and stuff like that so we come here a lot to buy food. Um, there are stores like where I'm at, like nearby, but for us to get like some kind of fresh seafood, we usually come here. So I may sneak inside there and show you. Uh, I might show you actually the next one because where we're going. Well, let's see, we got some restaurants here. And this place right here, see that haircut place? I usually go there, but because I just want to like the, a little trim on the back, we're just gonna go to another one here. Check this out. Uh, the cop car across me, you see? There's a, a bus stop and there's a car parked right next to it and they're trying to give him a ticket. See, oh, now he's moving. You see that Mercury? He's moving. That police lady was really nice to do that, to tell him to move because usually in the city, in Manhattan, what they'll do is they'll give you a ticket like that. And this guy got a break. Oh, this is like a Russian place here too? Check this out. Station. It's like it's Chinese, uh, Russian, but they have like uh, crafts and stuff for uh, kids, like you know, to second grade, third grade. All right, guys, we're here. So this is the place. It's called New Natural House Salon, and uh, we're gonna go in. We're gonna go in here, and we're gonna get. Uh, I don't see any trims, so it's gonna be. It's gonna be a different price. I don't think it's gonna be ten, but we'll see what they say. <laughs> Can you buy a 
啲思路去做嘢。呢啲唔使唔使，就係呢啲呢樣。耶耶，個個正正。Thank you. All right, guys. So I'm back in my area, and I hope you guys enjoyed the replays. Uh, th that this is a really strong deck, and if you get a chance, definitely uh, do try it out. And I got it off an attorney, and I think, but I think I played against like one of my friends because he told me about the attorney. And this is the clan again that I'm in, and we're about to open up this chest. On my other account, I just got three pekkas. So not a lot. People are getting legendaries, and I'm really looking forward to getting a miner because I still haven't gotten it. So anyway, guys, I'll catch you in the next one. The next uh, videos will probably be me, be me working on a uh, uh, on this mortar deck. I really want to learn how to play mortar, and I have the uh, goal to upgrade here. Let me upgrade actually right now. Yeah, we'll do this right now. Then I think I can do these archers. Archers are just a, a well-rounded card as is. So here we go. So we got these. And that was our new uh, log there that I just got. So yeah. So the next video will probably be on the mortar. And I really want to learn how to use it. I think it's going to come in handy in, uh, in, in the Hog Mountain. Anyway, guys, I'll catch you later.